Alrighty, here is a new version. Let's watch this whole thing in full. Two shots here, and wait for it. Ba -ba. All right, cool. So, what I would say, it's all coming along well. My biggest thoughts, or my main thoughts, are for this section here. But let's go through that. He's a bit poppy up and down. I think it's probably through up and down. And then especially here where it suddenly really pops down hard into this. Not that, you know, you can do things snappy, but it's probably the way I'm reacting. If you have such pronounced up and downs, especially with this, but at the same time, there's no real visible change in here. In terms of breakup, you're all super fancy. That means nothing. When, if the chest goes down, you would have you know a bit of a drag in the head and so on. Especially on something like this, where it's, she goes down, I would have her go up a bit, drag a bit, and then slight go forward. Not much, because she might hit the head here. But also things like the spacing of the head going forward to here, bam, and then goes back up. So that's like a one frame direction change hit I think all of that plus here when she goes up and floats and her arms go up but there's nothing really in the shoulder it's all very straight but there's nothing in the chest like there's no complication in terms of maybe one arm goes you know if this is even more pronounced in terms of offset and that would bring the chest over this way and more rotated in Y it just everything feels a bit stiff and in one axis, if that makes sense. That just feels a bit stiff here with the up and down. And then here again, you're going up here first. So there might be a bigger change in terms of the overall body pushing this up with the shoulder. Then this arm finally gets up and pushes more, which could get her get her over this side a bit more. Just stuff like that. Or even here, maybe one of the legs. I mean, this one goes further first here. There might be something in the rotation of the hips and then the push off and then a side to side. That with a bit of a change. Just everything feels just a bit too simplified and stiff. If that makes sense. If that makes sense. And I'm looking at not that you have to make dramatic changes to this in terms of she's looking back at us and then going looking forward and turning. Just I think there's also the feeling of maybe the repetition, the stiffness, because of all that. It's not that long. So what I thought was, it's always like, could we break this up where she would have maybe just finished a look back? I know this is a massive change. Like, don't do this. But my thought was, this is ever so slightly repetitive. Is there anything we can do to break this up a bit? Where maybe she is more bent over and then gets up, but then it might be too bent up and then bent down again. I don't want to be super destructive in the note, but just the general feeling of is there anything potentially more interesting that we could add? Even maybe like that arc or how the arm is out. Maybe just the swing here arm-wise is way different than here. Maybe that will already help. But I like, I mean, I still like all the ideas and how she gets up here, jump into... A uh, Super Mario something double jump. <laughs> Does Super Mario have a double jump? Now I don't know. Does Super Mario have a double jump? So many characters have double jumps. To be honest, I don't think Super Mario has double jumps. Wow, after 30 years or more of playing, I don't remember. But yeah, I like the mechanics a lot in all of this. Here, this is cool. I like how she gets in here. I like the complications of just the how the arms crossover watch out this feels like either some intersection stuff or a bit too loose too soon on the fingers maybe that could be tightened up a bit here here it gets a bit too ik where that is really stuck there bit of a too evenly spaced out fingers it goes to some grouping a little polish here and there but the main thing that i have is that she comes in here there's all this energy sits down i do like here that she's more leaned over but then watch out, it gets a bit too twin there. 
could be a bit more pushed in asymmetry and just offsets there. But once she gets here, this is the thing. She goes, oh, okay, come on. But there's something about this where if she's really that exhausted, because now we're getting into this look and the lean over, and I would then really push the shoulders further down, well, although they are further down here. That's from her inhale. Okay, never mind. Forget what I said. But it just feels rushed, where it feels like she should be... Ugh. Okay, what's going on here? Come on. Just a bit of a longer moment. But then my question to you is, would that be too weird? Because you have all this energy. Would too long of a rest here cut too much into the flow of this? So this is where I'm at. I'm slightly torn about this moment, where it feels a bit... Pose to pose, both arms go rip, oh, and it just feels rushed again. And also a bit stiff how she goes from here to here versus, like this doesn't feel comfortable. It almost be like a lean this way. Oh, and then back into, huh? And then you can change this into that change of the, the spine into that but even this in terms of come on feels so isolated through there while this is still here where i feel like there would be a bigger change especially if you're, if you're leaving this pose for being exhausted you're going through some mental changes of i'm exhausted and then wait a minute where it's a maybe surprise aggravation or you know like frustration into ah and then maybe that arm goes back up like, I feel like it's too simple in its approach of sitting down, pose to pose, stuck in this pose where only this is moving, despite quite a change in the emotion of, or just general attitude of, you know, I don't know how emotional she is, but going in there, getting ready, exhausted, waiting, realizing that's not working, frustrated, and let's go. It just feels almost a bit too casual with just that arm move there. And even then, as it goes down, you would think that, all right, well, let's get ready. Maybe while this goes down, she's still adjusting maybe the weight shift over, doing something with her hands. I don't know. This might all just be too much. This is just my general reaction. As always, these you know feedback sessions are all very subjective. But that's the thought that I have for this. Alrighty, let me know what you think. All right. There's an email, you can sign up, you can start whenever you want, you can submit whenever you want, you get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right, thank you.